Libras, and welcome back to my channel, Aquarian Empress Tarot. For those of you guys who are new to the channel, welcome to my returning Libras. Welcome back, you guys. This is going to be your December collective reading, Libra. Welcome back, babies. So if you're excited as, I'm, as much as I'm excited, let's get into this reading. So here's what we're going to do, Libra. We're going to get some spirit messages. We're going to go into the tarot. We're going to ask Spirit what messages you guys need to know in regards to your health, your finances, and love, and get general advice. Please keep in mind this reading will not resonate with every single Libra. It will not. But if it resonates with you, show your girl some love and leave a comment down in the comment section below. All right? And please thumbs up the video. All right, Spirit Universe, what messages do you have for the sign of Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? If you're a cusper, you'll get you may get a message from this too. Crosswalkers, if you get a message, great. If not, that's okay. It is okay. Ooh, we've got law of attraction. Law of attraction. So Spirit says visualize um what you want. Law of attraction. What you believe in will attract towards you. So make sure you're speaking positive affirmations over your life. Words have power. Words have power, Libra. So don't don't doubt yourself. Don't allow your fear or anxiety to creep up. Know that you are worthy and you deserve the absolute best. All right? But manifest. Set it and forget it. Write it out. Scripting is a good way to do manifesting, but prayer is a great way of manifesting as well. Ask. Ask God, spirit, source, however you identify for the things that you desire, but also show gratitude and then let it go and allow the blessings to flow. Let it go. Allow the blessings to flow. I like it. Let's see. Don't over obsess about it. Look, good fortune and unexpected income. Blessings upon blessings, Libra. Like I said, Whatever you guys have been manifesting, honey, it's about to show up. It's about to show up. Here. What are the messages you have for Libra? Keys. Unlocking truths and secrets of the unknown. Some of you guys may be tapping into your own spiritual gifts this month. Libra, for those of you guys, some of you guys may be tarot readers or whatever the case may be. But some of you guys may be tapping into your own intuition and learning how to read tarot or interpret messages, dream messages from spirit. Whatever the case may be, but Spirit says you may be discovering a lot of truths. You also may be discovering truths about the church, truths about organized religion. You may be start go really going deep with this in spirituality, what it's about, what it involves, what it entails, and what it means to you, right? And just keep in mind, Libra, that each one of us are on a different healing journey, a different spiritual journey. So there's no right or wrong way to do whatever it is that works best for you. No one knows what you need in this life but you. So don't let anybody make you feel bad for doing things a particular way. All right, Spirit. What are the messages in regards to finances? We're going to start with the money first, honey. In regards to finances, then we'll go into health and then we'll go into love, okay? That's all right with y'all, Libra. Money. Hermit. Hermit. Some of you guys are really trying, you guys are kind of, Taking a step back to really reevaluate your assets, what you have to bring to the table monetarily, what you need to change as far as your spending habits, because some of y'all overspend, Libra, you do. Seeing where you can cut back. Ace of Wands. Some of you guys may be starting a new job, Libra. If that's you, congratulations. Yes, congratulations. The star. Some of you guys are being very optimistic in regards to your job search. If you're still searching for employment, you haven't quite found it yet. Spirit says stay positive. Remember, you have the law of attraction. Also, if you've been, you know, hoping that you get the funds to take care of a particular thing or pay something off. Spirit says stay positive. Speak the, speak the positive affirmations into your life, Libra. Allow the universe to work for you. Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups. If you have a business, Libra, if you're an entrepreneur for whoever this message is for, make sure that you're giving it 110%. Give it your all because you're going to get out of it what you put into it. Okay? Go 
one more. Five of Swords. Some of you guys may be mentally overwhelmed with your job and you just about had it. You're exhausted. If that's you, quit. Put it into a notice. Go do something different. All right? Don't allow fear and the devil to creep in. Don't let him do it. Don't let him do it to you. You deserve better, Libra. If, if that's your story. Also, don't allow the finances to stress you out either. There's always a solution. Get help. Get help if you need help. There's people who are financial advisors. Feel free to con consult. Don't give up before you've even started, basically. Spirit, any other money advices for the sign of Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Messages for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. <clears throat> Look what I said. Toxic work environment. If you are stressed the hell out over a workplace environment, honey, if it's not giving what it's supposed to give, it's time to go. Bills will be paid. Things will be taken care of for you. You got to take the step and say, you know what, enough is enough. Especially if there's, if you're being mistreated, disrespected, walked all over. It, bye. Deuces. Business betrayal. Be careful of who you decide to partner up with if you are an entrepreneur because everybody is not honest and everybody doesn't have your best interests at heart, Libra. So be very careful of who you choose to, to engage with, especially if it's a family member or a close friend in um, business because sometimes people do selfish things. We're all human, okay? And human nature tends to be very self-centered. So just consider carefully. Also, be aware of someone taking advantage of you who works for you. Be proud of yourself. Mm -hmm. You're a star. In my Nicki Minaj voice. Be proud of yourself, Libra. You guys have been working hard and it's paying off. You're in for a sweet surprise. What did I tell y'all? Money, money in abundance, prosperity is going to be coming in for you guys this month. Huge breakthrough, finally. Yes. So the financial blessings, the career blessings are, yeah. Right now, your bank account may be on zero, but it's going to get some money in it, Libra, for whoever that message is for. So what are the messages in regards to health for the sign of Libra? Messages in regards to health. Messages in regards to health for Libra, please, and thank you. The Magician. Some of y'all might need to schedule an appointment to see the doctor. If you don't have a primary care physician, you might want to get one just to make sure that, you know, everything's functioning properly. Right? If it's been a while, schedule that female checkup. If you're a man, get everything, make sure everything's working, Okay. Get an STD screening. Make sure everything's good. All right. Mammogram. Whatever the case may be. But go get checked out. Make sure everything's good. Ace of Cups. Some of you guys need to drink more water. This is health. These messages are in regards to health. There was the message. Ace of Swords. Some of you guys need to learn to clear your mind. Clear your mind. So that way you can sleep better. Some of you guys have hard you some of you guys have a hard time sleeping because your mind is always turned on. Turn social media off if you have a habit of scrolling through social media, Instagram when you're in the bed, Libra. Go to sleep. Turn on like you know what it helps. Sometimes if you sleep with the TV on, it helps. I don't like to sleep with the TV on because it's chaos to me. Um, but if you read a book, if you read a book while you're laying in the bed or you turn on like nature, like rain sounds, it'll help you, help you get into a state of calm so that you can sleep better. The chariot, the chariot. Some of you might do well to do some physical extra, like move, get up and move. Like if you have a desk job, you wanna get up and move because when you're sedentary, trust me, I know, you tend to pick up more weight than if you're constantly active. So it may help for you guys to do a little bit of yoga, to do a little bit of physical exercise to help keep everything flowing, okay? Queen of Wands.
some of you guys may want to include peppers in your diet like spicy foods foods to help increase your <laughs> if you already have a high sex drive <laughs> it is what it is <laughs> but for those who don't you know to increase libido certain foods help aphrodisiacs and things of that nature like chocolates and stuff you know what i mean um ginger for males don't ask okay <laughs> but yeah some of you guys may want to add a little spice in your life a little razzle to your dazzle okay spice up your foods because it's it's not it not only does it taste good but it's also beneficial for the colon gut health okay so like habaneros jalapenos poblano y'all tell me a pepper in the comments that you like okay but peppers are great cayenne um chipotle <coughs> excuse me the peppers are great okay now let's go into the live portion libra peppers some like it hot libra <laughs> Fair, what's the messages for libra in regards to love what do they need to know in regards to love for the month of december Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Winter. Okay, so some of you guys have ended a situation that was no longer serving you. Or you're ending it. Water under the bridge. Yeah, you're over it. Over them. Yeah, the person was very in and out. They were very indecisive. Or you may have been indecisive about ending it, but you finally went ahead and ended it. So proud of you, Libra. Yeah, you've detached yourself from the situation. Catching bot. There's going to be someone else, though, that comes in for the saying that's going to want your attention or catch your attention. You've blocked somebody or you need to block them if you haven't. Because if you haven't blocked them, Libra, just saying, oh, well... I'm done. I'm over him or I'm over her. That ain't enough. That ain't shit. You got to block the person in order to finally cut them off. In order to cut ties, you got to delete pictures. You got to delete messages. Delete them. Block them. You're not really done if you're still hanging on, Libra. Unfollow, unfriend, um, unsubscribe. Like, you know what I'm saying? If you going to do it, do it all the way. Like, don't be like half-assing it. Like, oh, well, you know, I'm still, I'm going to wait and see if he takes me back. No, it's, it's a wrap. Okay, we're done. We're not doing that. If you, if you're done with it, the person doesn't know what they want. Let them figure it out on their own without you. Okay, that's the love messages. Let's get advice and we're going to close this out. We're gonna close it out. So what's the advice for Libra? Some got, somebody may have detached themselves from you, Libra. It could be the other way around. Cause you may have been very indecisive about what you want. It's water under the bridge to them. But you may still have feelings for them. Mm-mm, mm-mm. We not doing that either. Mm-mm. It's up to you, Spirit says, it's up to you this month to make changes to get what you want. It's up to you. Spiritual help, ask for guidance. Please stay in prayer and meditation. Please ask the universe for what you want. New opportunity, you will have a new opportunity. It's not the end of the world. If you ended a relationship, if that resonates with you, if not, unlikely, Unlikely, it's unlikely that this person um, is gonna reach out to you. Just so you know. Yeah, financial stability. Oh, spirits confirming. Thank you. Spirits confirming. Money coming your way. Prosperity coming your way, Libra. All right. So you guys are gonna have some new opportunities this month. Um, Spirit is saying the choice is yours. You know, you can choose to entertain the situation or if you, you can choose to let it go. It's highly unlikely though that this person has made up their mind. If this is if this resonates with you, if this is your story, the person you were dealing with was very wishy-washy and in, indecisive. It's unlikely that they finally decided what they want. You ain't got time for that. Spirit says focus on your bag, Libra. Because you're abundant, baby. 
So that's been your December Collective Reading Libra. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it. Turn on your post notifications, subscribe to the channel, and until next time, love you guys.